Good morning, room two. I am loving seeing all the cool things you are doing in your bubbles. Today I'm gonna to read you a story. It's another one of my favorites, and I think lots of you will have heard it before, and you may even have it at your house, and it's called The Very Hungry Caterpillar, and it is written by Eric Carl. The Very Hungry Caterpillar. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop! Out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, but he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through four strawberries, but he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges, but he was still hungry. One, two, three, four, five. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake, one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami, one lollipop, one piece of cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake, and one slice of watermelon. That night, he had a stomach ache. The next day was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf, and after that, he felt much better. Now he wasn't hungry anymore. And he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big, fat caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out, and... He was a beautiful butterfly. That end. Wow, what a beautiful butterfly. I wonder if some of you could draw a beautiful butterfly today. There are heaps of really cool activities as well that you can search online to do with the Very Hungry Caterpillar if you want to. I hope you enjoyed the story.